Hey, Luke the Gathering here, and it's bundle time. Ten draft boosters of Modern Horizons. You know what? I get a lot of Modern Horizons, obviously. I really just am in love with this stuff, but I don't really get a lot of draft boosters. I get a lot of the set boosters when I see them. Obviously, I get the collectors, boxes. I've gotten one of these before, and this is the second one. The first one I got for, like, full price, which was really expensive, but, um... This one, nope, pay that thing about $60 for this, so a lot more palatable for the purchase. And hopefully we'll pull something nice out of these booster packs, draft boosters. So these are the regular cards. I feel like, you know, I got a lot of the foils, and it's, I'm like, I need to get some of the regular cards here. I feel like the booster drafts, not the booster drafts, the um, set boosters and the collector's boosters, they're so different. You get just, I don't know, things are different when you buy these. So let's see what we, if we can get any good luck out of this. So let's see what we have. We got Braids. Everybody's scared of this card, and it is a scary one. Double Rare. Void Mirror. And some of the artwork, honestly, looks really different to me than when you get it in the collector version. Uh, the regular version, I don't know, there's just something about the regular version that I think is pretty nice. We got a couple of retro frames here. And a Shardless Agent. Nice. Shardless Agent. Ooh, Double Rare again. Resurgent Belief. And a Foil Deep Wood Denizen. Ugh, the only thing I don't like is one that packs shred like this. It just makes the opening experience that much worse. There. Alright, recalibrate. Kind of to recalibrate for that. Blacksmith Skull. And Diamond Lion, the rare. Not a big fan of the Diamond Lion. So far, nothing really great out of this uh, bundle. Hopefully we can pick up some heat as we move on. The Scoundrel, that's a really cool looking card, the Scoundrel. And we're going all the way to a... Oh, okay. That's something I can live with, Misty. Rainforest in the retro frame as the rare. What a beautiful card. I don't know, and there's something about maybe because I have so many of the foils that getting it in non foil is super exciting. I don't know, I just something about the old school look of it. Galvanic relay, so I was complaining about no fetch lands, and we grabbed one, so that's really cool. Dress down and altar of goif. So, Misty Rainforest. No matter what happens, pretty happy with that pull. But let's see if we can grab anything else while we're at it. Underworld Cookbook. Very nice. And Territorial Koivu. Okay. So nothing too crazy there. We still have oh, three packs after this, I think. Shuffle, 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 shuffle. And Solitary Confinement. That's a cool looking card. And Double Rare, Nykthos Paragon. And Beast. Alright, so three more packs to go. So far we got the Misty Rainforest. Very, very happy with that one already. So let's see if we can get some extra goodness out of this. Mind Collapse. And Turok Dread Canter. Mythic, so that's nice. We got another mythic here. Turok Dread Canter. And two more to go. And we have Ooh, Shardless Agent in the retro frame. That's really nice. And then Magus of the Bridge. The good looking card there. Graceful restoration. Pretty good pack, that one. And here it is, our final pack. Blazing Rootwalla, that's cool looking. And Harmonic Prodigy. So nothing too crazy there, but um, let's put that food token away. Let's go over the rares and mythics. So we got the Magus of the Bridge, Shardless Agent in the Retro Frame. I like that one a lot. Turok, Dread Canter, the Paragon, Solitary Confinement, 
Kavu, Dress Down, Best Card right here, Misty, Rainforest, we got a Diamond Lion, Resurgent Belief, another Shardless Agent, Void Mirror, Braids, and a Harmonic Prodigy. So there you have it, one bundle of Modern Horizons 2. I like it, maybe it takes some more bundles. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.